They're a bit naive, and I'm not sure they'd really understand. There's enough shit to worry about without me piling more on top. <sighs> I don't even know where to start. <laughs> The beginning. Yeah, okay. So, the truth is, I'm not from North Carolina. I only visited my gramps there. I'm California born and raised. Napa Valley. Over the years, it's kind of grown into a community of wealthy old folk who like things and people who don't change. My parents were no exception, and I was a little too different for their tastes. It was hard growing up with them. They never gave me too much hell, but things were tense, especially after my sister Catherine moved out. Eventually, she was set up securely in Neo SF, and she offered to let me live with her until I got out of school. I think my parents were a little relieved to see me out. I was ecstatic to be free of them. I worshipped the ground my sister walked on, and that was before I found out what she did for a living. She was flashy and colorful and a whirlwind of activity, and she was a brilliant hacker. She was Tomcat. She let me learn at her feet, and once I was good enough, folded me into her little coup of crackers hell-bent on changing the world. <laughs> She's the one who orchestrated the original hack on Parallax, exposing to the world the holes in their original MeshNet security. I was just along for the ride. She always knew she would get caught, though. How could she not? Parallax was one big Goliath, and she flinged a stone square in their face. She was looking at serious jail time, and willing to eat it to do what we all thought was right. It just wasn't right. It wasn't fair for her to throw her life away, and I couldn't let her. She was always better at software than hardware, so I rigged all of our computers to self-destruct. When the feds showed up at our door, all of our server farms were already up in smoke. I gave her quite a fireworks show. Before she could stop me, I turned myself in as Tomcat and took credit for the whole job. She tried to talk me out of it. Without the physical evidence, they couldn't prove she had anything to do with it. It's alright, though. It was for the best. I figured I'd just get a year of juvie. I'd be back out in no time. No big deal, right? Especially when compared to the time that she'd have been jailed for as an adult. And so, I waited patiently. I cooked up so many ideas on how I was gonna make it up to her. I knew she must have blamed herself. But before I ever got out, there was an accident. An auto cab hit my sister. She died on impact. That was it. It's hard blaming yourself when things go wrong because you did something right. I took her sentence so that she could have a laugh, and instead, not being in jail killed her. Oh, if I had just let her take the blame, I can't stop thinking about how she'd still be here. And no matter what I told myself, in my heart, I couldn't believe it was just an accident. Do you know how rare it is for those things to hit a human? Someone knew who she was. Someone knew what she did, and someone wanted to make sure she would never do it again. So I became Tomcat. I've spent years trying to find information inside Parallax to prove someone inside the company called a hit on my sister. Failing that, I've been trying to find a way to bring them down the way she always wanted. Catherine was... <laughs> if you had met her, just for a moment, you would understand. She was everything I could ever want to be. But over time, that little bot has grown on me. Maybe you have to. I do. The 
threat of Big Blue is real, and we're the only ones who can do something about it. It's bigger than me and my vendetta. I just wanted to get that all off my chest. My sister, she'd smack me if she knew I've been holding this grudge. I'm trying to learn to forgive myself. Still, I won't let her go unavenged. We're so close to bringing them all to justice. I just... I know she'd be proud. I know if she were here, she'd be right next to us, helping until the end. I've been carrying all this for so long, and... I finally feel like I'm getting somewhere. Thanks for hearing me out. I hope we can really do this. Friends, I've returned. I'm ready. Good. We've wasted enough time already. I've marked the location of the data center on your map. You'll have to go in and get the source code mostly on your own, but I'll load on some programs that'll give you an edge. We'll do our best, Tomcat. But what happened to your accent? Uh, oh, don't you worry about that. It comes and goes like a vagabond kitty. <laughs> get going, you two. I have lots of code to write, and you have a lot of data to download. Stay in touch. Of course, Tomcat. Thank you again. Don't worry about it, hon. We've all been hurt by Parallax. It's about time we hurt him back. 